going on you savages welcome back to more wwe 2k18 coverage so it is the weekend and just like last weekend i figured i'll give you guys a roundup of everything that we discussed this week plus more latest news that we got this weekend in regards to wwe 2k18 including a potential date that could be the day that wwe 2k18 is finally confirmed nonetheless guys let's get right to it you guys already know the deal make sure that you guys turn on those notifications uh, to be fully up to date on all things wwe 2k18 uh, leading up to the release least day of the game nonetheless you savages last week roundup we got over 800 likes so let's make sure that we do the same but onto the news at first we're going to be doing the recap and then we're going to be discussing the latest updates so early on the week the coverage actually started with nba 2k18 being revealed by nba 2k and the special thing about it was the fact that it's going to be coming out for last gen xbox 360 and ps3 meaning that take two interactive still is interested in releasing game for last gen so there are making their developers such as nba 2k come out with the game for last gen user which means that there's probably money there involved so since we got nba 2k a take two interactive developer making the game for last gen chances are that wwe 2k will also be coming out for last gen since again a take two interactive is probably asking wwe games to continue making the game for last gen pretty redundant there but i did wanted to make that point following that we got some leak of wwe 2k 18 actually and pretty much the confirmation of it as we had ben ban bader reveal on twitter that he will be part of the wwe 2k18 roster he then went on to delete the tweet now obviously wwe 2k18 hasn't officially been announced by take two interactor or by wwe 2k therefore this was a tweet that he was not supposed to send out chances are that he was contacted right away to remove the tweet nonetheless what's interesting about this is pretty much the fact that 2k is definitely getting set up to do the big reveal and that is definitely what they are doing because the next day we finally got the wwe 2k twitter giving us a hint of the next game and they'd even hinted at the possible cover star of the game this year which definitely made a lot of us happy so they went on twitter and they hinted at the game and also the cover star by linking us to a element games video which showcase custom cover art and the way that they linked us to that video was specifically by choosing the screenshot which shows a custom cover star of the undertaker wwe 2k certainly dropped dropping it for us right there after hinting something so big like this and knowing that we want the undertaker to be the cover star so much i don't see them going another route so it certainly looks like we're gonna be getting the undertaker as the cover star of wwe 2k18 moving on and on to some latest news that i'm yet to cover and it looks like we're finally gonna be getting a new commentary team this is actually an old tweet but nonetheless it's kind of making much more sense right now so michael cole he went on twitter early on on february and he indicated my life just can't get away from byron saxon voice work for a special project at the performance center and then he tags the other announcers jbl and Corey graves now since february we haven't heard anything in regards to what specifically this project is and there hasn't been any project involving byron saxon and michael cole that we have heard of and that is not live such as monday night raw so it looks like byron saxon is gonna be added to the commentary team i would not be surprised if this year's commentary team will consist of michael cole jbl and byron saxon hopefully we do get Corey graves and the last piece of news that i got for you guys is that take two interactive earning conference call will be held on may 23rd at 4 30 p.m usually in this conference call they reveal the list of games that are going to be coming out at the end of the year on the last quarter and last year this was actually the first confirmation this actually revealed the game even before wwe 2k confirmed the game so if by the 23rd of this month wwe 2k has hasn't announced anything yet it will happen in that day or it will happen in that week and usually a day or two after that it is followed by a pre-order bonus reveal so again uh, things are definitely getting heated up make sure that you guys turn on those notifications just to be fully up to date on everything and that is what i have for you guys for this wwe 2k18 news roundup make sure that you guys elbow drop that like button if you guys like this roundup episodes and thank you savages for watching we're in the world to 20 000 subscribers I'm going to tell you, dig it!